and this is from the fisherman violence. So our next topic is on pain, the peripheral artery disease, and farm goes to surgical matters. We'll be the one to take. Good day all, my name is from Mercy Square Surgical Matter Puno. I'm here to talk on peripheral artery disease and then like I'm just trying to guide you on what you should know about the disease. Thank you. Peripheral artery disease or peripheral vascular disease is a disease that is characterized by abnormal narrowing of the arteries that supply blood to other organs than the heart and the brain. That is any other organ that supplies blood apart from the brain and the heart. The heart cause mainly invasions of the body like that is the hands, the leg, the leg especially then sometimes it can be seen in the skin and then in the kidney. The symptoms include leg pain which resolves when you rest, skin ulcer, cold skin, bluish skin or abnormal hair growth on the affected leg. Causes of PAD include atherosclerosis, which is when the arterial walls are clogged up by fat particles. Then the artery spasm, which is the involuntary contraction of the of the muscles of the artery. Then we have the blood clots and trauma. The complications include infection, amputation, and tissue death. Amputation is when you have to cut off the affected part, be it the hand or the leg. The risk factors include smoking, diabetes, high blood pressure, kidney problem, and high blood cholesterol. Management can be classified into two types, the non-drug and the drug management. For the non-drug management, you have, you have to stop smoking, then in extreme cases, surgery, and then you have to exercise regularly. Then for the drug management, we have medications that can help you and to treat it, which includes the statins and then the ACE inhibitors. Thanks.